All right, guys. So you y'all have been riding me for two weeks. Now we have a uh, smooth, uh, very extremely responsive uh, aim now. So the uh, downside of this is that uh, we we're, we only stay grounded uh, when we're rotating on small angles. Uh, but if we if we start doing this number then uh, the feet will start sliding uh, because the way that I did it, if we come over here to the anim graph and you select this, I don't know why I never even considered doing this before, to be honest with you. I already knew what this did, but basically the max rotation error, it tells it um, how much it's allowed to counter rotate the root to keep him grounded. Uh, if you set a limit, and you exceed that limit, then it'll stop accumulating. Uh, accumulate means counter rotate. Um, it'll it'll stop counter rotating to keep them in place, and it'll release it and allow allow his feet to slide. Uh, so I set it to 89, which is right below 90. 90 is our max angle for our aim offset. That's the reason why I set it to 89. If you if you go into my update DAO data, uh, right over here where the aim offset is, um, this is actually going to be uh, disconnected to uh, for now. Uh, so you can reconnect this if you and set this back to negative one. If you want to keep him ground, if you don't like that, then you can set it back. Uh, I'm showing you how to do that now. Uh, so first off, you're going to want to uh, hook this back up because this uh, prevents jerking whenever we reach our limit and we're waiting on the animation. Uh, this right here pre prevents the wrapping uh, from being instantaneous. Uh, so that's what that's for. And inside of here, this needs to be hooked up because this is actually subtracting uh, uh, the root offset from this uh, to help prevent that jerking issue. So that's basically the rundown on it. Now, if you're if if another player is watching you do this, obviously he's going to see you. Uh, He's going to see your feet sliding. When the user's doing it, it's not really that noticeable most of the time, unless you're deliberately looking down and watching the feet, uh, and, and you're doing it at, at just the right rate, then, then you may see it sliding. But it's going to be really hard for the player to actually see that, and it adds a lot of responsiveness. It basically fixes all the problems. As you can see, there's no wraparound now. Uh, so that was one of an, another complaint that somebody was making, and you see, I'm moving at like fifty thousand G's over here, and uh, and it's not breaking it. So uh, that should tell you something. You wanted a competitive responsiveness, and now we got it. So also, I doubt that anybody would even notice if they are watching you and you were uh, moving. And it did that. So anyway, that's basically the rundown on it, guys. I'm going to keep it like that. I showed you how to reverse it if you wanted to. And I'll see you in the next video.